Big friendly war game here again. It is Monday, start of a new week, it's 3rd of June. Um, I'm going to start showing you what I'm doing with my Death Guard this week. I've done just finished some painting um, and I've done a little bit on them. Uh, more base colours, um, needed more shading afterwards. But I'll get to that tomorrow probably. It's, it's getting on now for I've got to have something to eat before I go to work and all that fun. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to show you what I've done on them uh, today. Uh, the way they're, they're panning out, I should have them finished for over the weekend. Uh, I know it's Monday, the weekend's far away, but yeah, you don't know. Who knows? But we'll see. So I'm going to turn the camera around and show you where I'm at. Right, so here's the three guys. Uh, the two Death Shroud Terminators and the uh, Plague Surgeon. Uh, to show you one of these Terminators. So this is the... Uh, the champion now as you can see I've painted the skin I've painted the silver and I actually have painted the uh, cloth but the cloths on the back of the model so you'll see I'll just zoom in a bit as you can see and this guy has got a lot of flesh on his back basically it's almost like his flesh is pouring out of his armor um, but that's all, all base coated uh, I've still got to base coat the axe black on the axe uh, base coat the red for the sh on the shoulders, uh, the black on the weapon, uh, any joints on whatever, whatever. Then I've got to sort out what I'm going to do on this helmet. Now this helmet's weird. Let me just zoom in some more. It's it's like a half broken helmet. It's not a proper Terminator helmet either. Um, focus. So he's got his mouth showing. And it's almost just like he's got a bucket on his head. Um, so I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do with that. I've got to paint the, the cabling as well. Um, but yeah, he's mostly base coated now. Uh, now this is the second Blight Lord Terminator. Now he's got a lot less flesh on him. Uh, big uh, loincloth. I've painted the silver on the, um, the chain mail. I don't know what I'm going to do with the sword yet. I'll have to uh, wait and see when I get there. Uh, now, the, both of these Blight Lord Terminators have got weird, like, skulls, uh, heads as, as their power points, which is weird. And also, I found very weird, his uh, armor seems to be controlled by the um, the effects that his, his anus is making. So, he, he's fart-powered. He's fart-powered Terminator. Um, which is ridiculously silly, but there you go. This cloth on the shoulder is going to be red, same as the um, the other bits of the shoulders. Like I said, I don't know what I'm going to do with the sword. Uh, I'll figure it out when I get to it. And now this is the Plague Surgeon. Now, this is... It, the thing I found kind of weird with this... Like, he's got a lot of cloth, which is fine. He's got very, very little amount of flesh on him. You've got that bit there. And I've noticed he's got the tentacle that's holding onto the bell there. But he hasn't got, like, flesh pouring out of him like the rest of the Death Guard have. Um, so, yeah, I, I've painted the robes. Uh, I've started work on the drill. So he's just painted silver and he needs uh, shading. Um, all these little vials will need painting. Probably filled with green pus and stuff like that. Um... His chainsaw needs paint in black. Um, and I've got to paint his face. Now, and this is the backpack as well. Let's see if I can get a decent angle on the backpack. It's not a lot on there, to be honest. So, I've got to paint all the cabling and stuff again. Uh, shade the silver. But yeah, there we go. That's the three Death Guard that I'm painting at the moment. Um, I've, I was painting, doing some work on some Beastmen, but I decided to get stuck in with these guys. I've been painting for about... Uh, what is it? It's ten past four now. I've been painting for about an hour and a half. And, uh, yeah, I've just got a few things I've got to do before I uh, think about having something to eat. So, But there you go. It's progress on my Death Guard. Uh, tomorrow I'm planning on... Shading the colours that I've already got down, and then probably, probably that'll be it for tomorrow on them. Because like like I said, 
as you can see the cloth between his legs is the backing of the uh, chain mail um, but yeah we'll see we'll see what I do tomorrow um, I've, I'm still working I've, I've got work till Thursday night and then I've got Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday off so let's just see where we go from here um, but yeah Light Lord Terminators and uh, Plague Surgeon on the way Alright everyone, so it's Tuesday, quick update, um, more base colours done on these uh, Death Guards, you can see from this guy, his sword painted black, his gun's black, he's got a red uh, cloth over his shoulder, the um, cloth, the loincloth is now um, shaded, and all the flesh is shaded as well, the horns have got another layer of Agrax, and basically it's quite close to being finished. The cloth has got to be finished, and um, I've got to do something with the sword, and then the base, and it's done. Uh, this is the champion. And I've got to paint the um, the actual handle of his axe. It's going to be painted the same width as the horns and stuff, the same uh, cream colour. But yeah, he's coming on quite nicely as well. Still not sure what to do with the helmet though, because it's a weird face that he's got I'll sort something out I don't know what I'm going to do with that um, but yeah all the flesh is shaded on this one as well and then obviously the uh, plague surgeon whose big robes have been shaded uh, sword painted and uh, bits of his silver have been uh, shaded as well painted all the skin on him too so they're all coming on fairly nicely um, I think I reckon another one or two maybe maybe one or two more painting sessions that'll be done um, I've been doing some work on my beastman as well um, but yeah I mean they're coming on quite nicely um, now I've got another model that I may add to the, my death guard which is um, a, a cow spawn I know Death Guard are allowed to take spawns, so I may actually do that. Um, I've got two other spawns somewhere as well, but I think they're on square bases, so I'll have to change them to round bases. Um, but yeah, I think spawn fit in quite well with the Death Guard aesthetic, so maybe we'll do that, maybe we're not. I'm not sure. But yep, yeah, that's it for Tuesday's update, and I will see you tomorrow. Hey everyone, it's uh, Thursday. Um, I don't think I've done on a Wednesday update, but we'll see. I can't remember. Um, so yeah, a little update on what I've done today. Um, I've painted, I've finished the highlights on the flesh. They need a bit of a glaze before they're done. So I glaze them with yellow to give them a bit of a putrid look. Uh, I've shaded the red. Um, I've got to shade the uh, handle of the axe. And uh, more or less, these guys are done. I've just got to base them. Uh, with this guy, i done the bale sword in a kind of weird way. Um, it was painted black. I put a little bit of a highlight of, uh, what was it, Celestra Grey. And then I gave it a, a glaze of Nicolac Oxide. A uh, glaze of, uh, what was it, green, Coella green shade, and then a no no. Give it this kind of um, weird, not looking right sort of look, which is what I wanted. I was pretty happy with that. So, again, this guy, his flesh is all shaded. The, the cloth on the side is uh, shaded as well. And again, I've got, to do, I've got to actually finish the cloth, which is a couple of layers. And I've got to dry brush all the bone and the spiny parts. But coming close. They're getting close to being finished. Now this guy's got a bit more to do on him. Um, as you can see all this, all this stuff on his belt I've got to paint. Which is all the vials. Uh, now I've got a way of doing that that I quite like. And I'm going to do it again on him. So it make him stand out quite a bit. Obviously his robes have got to be paint, uh, finished. Um, got to finish work on his um, Nothesium. Or whatever they, the Death God call it. And uh, yeah, then I've got to finish his backpack. I his backpack there. So he's got a head on the bottom of it. The backpack's almost done. 
it's just a few little bits and pieces so yeah they're not far off now it just takes a fuck takes a fault so the three death guards that i've got left um i'm almost certain i'll have these finished by the weekend um but yeah coming on fairly fairly nicely now um i've been doing other painting as well um i i may actually have uh nine maybe ten models finished by the weekend it's been nice but that's uh, thursday's update i will see you tomorrow hi right, everyone so it's sunday you have to excuse me having missed a few days but i have been working on my death guard and they are actually finished now these three um so you've got the plague surgeon i really like his uh vials of um goo that he's got to inject he's also got some blood in some of them as well as you can see from there yeah actually really quite happy with how he turned out really really quite happy got the the rotting head uh head grenade on his back yep yeah, very very happy with him as you can see his robes are a bit um big bit rotten rather than being clean like space ring robes should be so that's him we got the um plague uh no no blight lord terminator this this is just the normal guy with his bell sword again I, I wasn't too sure about that bell sword about how it looks but turns out yeah it's not too bad it's, it looks a bit weird but it's supposed to because it's chaos so and this is the Blight Lord Terminator champion with his combi melter and his um, axe, which I can't remember the name of. Um, I like him. He's, it looks like he's kind of... The flesh is flowing out of his armour, um, struggling to contain his, his body sort of thing because he's got a big gut as well. Um, just proof that even us big guys, us overweight guys, can be space marines in the 41st millennium. So... There you go. So that is it. That is, again, my Death Guard are up to date. Um, now, I have got three more Terminators that I could build, but I don't want to. Um, I've got a Cow Spawn, which I may add to this. Um, I may pinch the other two Spawn from my Chaos Army as well to make a unit of three. Um, but yeah... It's going to be a couple of weeks until Conquest turns up again. And I'm not sure there's any Death Guard in that. So you may not see updates for a little while. I think next week what I'll do, though, is I'll get the whole army out. I'll, I'll set them up on the table and I'll um, do a showcase of what I've done of them so far. Um, but yeah, there we go. That is uh, my Death Guard for, for this week. Sorry it's been a bit short and sorry I've missed a few days, but... Like I said, I have been working on them. I've just been working on other stuff too, as you can see from this lot there on the set desk. But but yeah, so that's the two Blight Lord Terminators and the Plague Surgeon. Uh, all done for the Death Guard. Um, I might actually get a game of them eventually, uh, but who knows. <laughs> so, yeah, I will see you all probably next week with uh, This Is My Army So Far. Um... And yeah, if, you, if you're liking these videos, please subscribe to my channel. Um, it helps me. I want to eventually make a channel where I can actually start, um, start kind of relying on it a little bit. And I, I, I want to put more effort into it. It's just it's difficult at the moment because I've got a full-time job as well. So yeah. So that's it for this week. I will see you hopefully next week.